Hi, my name is Tom Currier. I'm a 20-year veteran of the Interesis GTAC. This video is to assist you with implementing basic policy on your network. Policy Manager comes pre-configured with several policy domains. In this case, we'll select something called the default policy domain. This comes with a set of rules, which are common to most users, and individual services to support them. In order to apply these to a switch, we have to pull a switch into the domain by pulling down the domain menu and selecting Assign Device to Domain. We'll select our device, add it to the policy domain, and select OK. We'll then see the device come up under Network Elements. And we can look at the General tab and get some general information about the device. To push policies down to it, we do an Enforce. The Enforce brings up a preview screen which shows us information, including statistics about what we are writing down, any mappings or classes of service that we're going to use, any VLANs we may be pushing down, and individual classification rules and roles. We enforce it down, and it writes policy down to the switch. The next step is to actually apply policy to either users or ports. Dynamic policy can be applied to users through authentication or we can set policy on ports by setting a default role. Under the Details view, we can expand out the ports, and we can individually select or multi-select various ports, right-click on them, and select Set Default Role. In this case, we'll set port 3 with the Guest Access Role. Once that's done, Guest Access shows up as the default role on this port, and now users that attach to that port will be limited by the guest access policy. Thanks for watching and please call one of our global 800 GTAC numbers for assistance with this or any other policy issues. Feel free to ask for me and I'll be more than happy to assist if I'm available. More information is available on our website at enterosis.com/support.